Hey guys and welcome to another episode. So on today's episode I'm going to work on installing some European E-Code headlights on from VX Tuning on my Mark IV Jetta TDI wagon. Uh, I also have some new Hella horns. I have a fog light wiring harness. I have a new replacement grill because uh, mine's or lower grill section because mine's uh, busted out. Um, so yeah um, I look forward to having these lights installed because the ones in here are super yellow and they're like absolutely horrible on my morning drives to work. Uh, so with that, uh, let's get right into it. Before we get started, I do want to do a before and after of headlights, or maybe a before and save the after for later. Uh, but my headlights driving down the road at night for low beams and high beams, and also the horn to see how lame this horn is and then hopefully these hell horns are going to be a little bit of an improvement. These Mark IV bumpers are surprisingly easy to remove, undoing the hood latch, grill, removing a bunch of Torx bolts, unplugging the side markers, and the bumper comes right off. Since the US market headlights didn't come with factory fog lights, I had to mount a relay and wire up the fog light harness in order to get these new lights to work. Here I am pinning the passenger fog light into the OEM plug. I used a coat hanger and tape to feed the fog light relay wire through the firewall into the headlight switch.
I made custom connectors for the Hello Horns that would allow me to restore to the OEM horns if desired at a later date. The brackets that came with the Hello Horns are not the most sturdy. I'm curious to see how these hold up over time. I doubled up on the brackets to help out somewhat. Hey guys, so that's a wrap on this week's episode. I've been driving the car for a few days now with the new new lights and they're uh, absolutely awesome. Definitely can finally see you again at night, uh, which is not, it's great for just like even safety. Uh, I felt like I was like limited on speed at night before just based on the amount I could see, but now these are super bright, especially in the high beams. The low beams, I feel like I need to adjust up a little bit. They're kind of more or less the same. It's nice having the fog lights low too, throw a little bit more light in the short range, but the high beams are awesome on these, far better. Uh, it's nice having the new radio, um, just having all the modern like Bluetooth and being able to charge your phone. And the sound quality is, I'd say like marginally better for a similar input, but um, definitely a little bit of an improvement. And then for like just listening to your like podcast and stuff is a thousand times better because before I had knock cable with the tape depth. So it's a huge improvement. Uh, so I hope you guys liked this episode. Uh, if you really liked it, then go ahead and like and subscribe so you can see more of my wagon content. All right. Thanks guys. Bye.